Managing this intersection in Jakarta takes courage and experience, and Junaidi has plenty of both. For over two decades, the 47-year-old, also known as Dedi, has been helping reduce traffic jams in this megacity, despite his disability. Because his hearing is impaired and he can't speak, he relies on his wife to communicate. Thank God he has work. He's got the trust of the police too. He was even given a uniform like the police. Because of his enthusiasm, the police were very happy with Dedi. Because he's alone, is a disabled person, couldn't talk, didn't go to school, he could only be a traffic director, as long as he's got an income. With its unpredictable traffic jams, Jakarta struggles with congestion. Unofficial traffic directors help prevent a total collapse, assisting cars and trucks, particularly at crossings that lack traffic lights. These polisi cepek, as they are known, work in exchange for tips from drivers. There are thousands of them across town. And on a good day, people like Rowimin earn quite good money, even more than a taxi driver. I'm here from 6 to 8 in the morning. For two hours, I make 12 euros. After that, I don't do it again. We take turns. Even railway crossings are under our control, since many police officers are not keen on the job. This railway crossing with no automated barrier in South Jakarta has been managed for years by Sole, a local who's in charge of a group of 12 workers. Twenty-four hours a day, 365 days a year, his team is right here. New members are carefully selected. Not everyone can come and just work here. There's this guy who has a wife. He had work, but is now unemployed and needs help. Then he's welcome to work here. I tell him the rules and the working hours, but this job is for locals only. It's 5 p.m., and after eight hours working the traffic, Junaidi calls it a day and heads back home. Along the way, he picks up his wife from work. Now the couple themselves have to face Jakarta's rush hour. In recent years, traffic jams in Indonesia's capital have decreased. Jakarta is no longer among the top 10 most congested cities in the world. Some say thanks in part to the Polisi Cepek, but others disagree. There are times when they're helpful, but there are times when they prioritize the people giving them money and hold up those who don't, and that causes traffic jams. When we don't have any small change in the car, we won't give them money, and they end up cursing us out. But of course there are others who don't do that when they receive no money. Back at Junaidi's house, his wife Sutini has turned the day's earnings into a nice dinner. The two have no kids or other relatives, but only each other to take care of. Dedi, if you're being taken care of by me, your wife, please listen. Don't just eat a little, take a lot. Get your vitamins as well so that you'll stay healthy. Dedi, don't you love me? Trinity hopes to keep working at the intersection for many years to come. Unlike some people who quickly lose their nerve in the traffic. He actually likes being in the midst of the chaos, and it gives him a good feeling to change things for the better.